Welcome to the Home for Innovation. And we're following up on a multi-part segment here at the Home for Innovation where we're discussing a manufacturing renaissance. First, we've been discussing the problems facing manufacturing, and as we move forward, we'll be talking about the goals to move us out of this quagmire into a position of long-term success again. So we had five problems we reviewed last time. We want to tackle another five that are facing manufacturing here on this episode. So what are we talking about today? We're talking about direct tort costs. Tort. This is a legal, us suing each other over different compliance issues. Direct tort cost equals almost 2% of the United States GDP. This is the highest in the world. The highest in the world. The health care costs have increased on average 12% over the last 10 years. And with the new Obamacare, we're going to see that number go up precipitously. 95% of consumers live outside the U.S., and this means that manufacturers in the U.S. need access to global markets in order to make sure they're serving those opportunities. Currently, there are dozens of, tr of free trade agreements going on around the world, but we are a party to only one of them. And through an action on free trade, we are conceding market share to our competitors. We are essentially persona non gratis in some of these emerging markets. So instead of taking advantage of an emerging market where we could be selling product, essentially they're taking advantage of us. We are buying products from those emerging markets. This is a problem that's not sustainable long term in order to manage, make sure we manage real wealth for Americans moving forward. Join us here next time on the Home for Innovation as we continue this segment on driving a manufacturing renaissance.